trauma they have, the post-trauma they have after being traumatized and being um, trafficked to those countries where they go to work and then in the end of that day uh, we cannot understand what they went through because it's really hard for them to tell what they went through because it's hard to explain and someone can feel what they are going through sometimes. So uh, what I take on this as is that uh, people are going to see the reality of life and pain of these people that they go through so that they can understand that uh, however much you leave your country to go to their side you're running away from a problem you again sometimes you run back again the problem. So um, according to the way we've read the script, basically it's contemporary dance. And uh, for it's quite technical for contemporary dancing, most people have basics in ballet. But right now, since we are not ballet dancers and we're not really going to learn like the whole technique of ballet, but there are standard things that stand out in contemporary dance, which are emotions and body movements, and then basically being free with your body. ASIA is a project about human trafficking. Um, focusing on human trauma, sorry, focusing on post-trauma. Uh, we, we have uh, survivors as writers of this project and I'm one of them, I'm a survivor and I know what, uh, I, I really understand what we go through after uh, trafficking. It is really so, so bad and so hard to survive. So. Since the three of us survived, we thought that we should do something to help someone out there who has no voice, uh, to give them hope, to give them a, a sense that they can move forward even after trafficking. And then you bring it to the left, to the left, yeah. So it's like you're still having that same motion of the chest movement and how far you push it, then this side. I was trafficked. I'm a victim of human trafficking. In 2017, I was taken to the Middle East. I was promised I'm going to work in a hotel, which didn't happen. I was enclosed in a house for two years. I, I worked for nothing. They were not paying me. I was sick and I'm still sick, I need an operation, but I can't get the money because I came back with nothing. So I, I joined a CIA team to help me tell my story, help me make my dream come true, support a CIA film. You understand, because um Sometimes people, it's really hard for them to tell these stories because they don't find them like most of times uh, commercial, for commercial purpose. They are always mostly done by um, NGOs because, uh, they are mo because someone can even say, they, okay, I want to tell this story and then they'll be like, no, I can't tell this story. But if these people have come up to Omti Creation, they have come up to tell this story, I think it's, it will give a purpose to the Ugandan community. As in which man? 
Seven or Campa, I will be the Baba, call it the jail. I will cast work no weave. Asia The Last Queen ist ein Film, der von drei jungen Frauen geschrieben wurde, die alle drei Opfer des Menschenhandels wurden. Es erzählt die wahre Geschichte und wir unterstützen diesen Film, weil wir glauben, dass es wichtig ist, diese jungen Frauen zu empowern, sie zu unterstützen und wir, wir glauben daran, dass wir gemeinsam Menschenhandel bekämpfen können. Not even a message from you. Nobody understands me. What about shutting up and letting me be? There should be that last person to be trafficked. I am Modesta May, I am Asia, the last queen. And I believe that human trafficking can stop and together we can stop it. Grace to see me, I'm the last queen. Anzom Gabi Mwonge, Elang and Oza and Techun to Chokusavan to Sichirunji, Museum of Inunio, Gutufu Mirida, Elang Oza and Tiwaino Kubao, Navachala, same by you, Elangaye, Asia.
Linda. Asia is a film inspired by true events and it's also addressing the issue of post-trauma post um, that affects the mental health of the victims of human trafficking. So if you care about human trafficking, if you care about the, its effects, if you care about the mental well-being of other people, Asia is a project for you and you should actually come through to support us in every way you can by connecting with us via social media asia the last queen is the ash the hashtag on facebook asia the last queen film instagram asia the last queen and you can also email us at filmcasting at owl.com yes and um, so yeah we should really come through